My name is Michael Reed, and uh, welcome to uh, Michael Reed at Elizabeth Bay. I have several galleries, um, one here at Elizabeth Bay and one in Mararundi. And I'll be towards the end of 2012 opening up a space in London as well. This gallery, we have a big advisory service, we have a big secondary market um, trading uh, position, we represent artists, we run a large art education program, we have a, a big publication um, d division, I suppose you'd say now. Um, you know, we print and publish a number of books every year. So I guess there's a, uh, an art transport business which we run as well. So this is more of a kind of an arts hub, I suppose. Um, and we run out of a four-storey uh, house in Elizabeth Bay. My job is a job of choice. It's not a job of predicament. I have worked in a number of industries. I'm a lawyer by training and I was a criminal lawyer for a very long time. I've worked a long time ago uh, in a galaxy far, far away. I worked on the land when I was very young. Uh, I come from the country. And I've also worked in academia. You know, Art Month came at the right time. It was a very simple idea. It's about a bunch of really creative people who work with creative people and what they can do collectively. Um, so the, the shout out started and, and uh, sent out a simple email and expected to get 20 or 30 res responses and I did. But then in the first year it just exploded. It was just this extraordinary thing that grew off into a life of its own. And now Art Month has gone into a whole new universe which is much bigger than anyone e ever anticipated and that's the beauty of it. It's viral. It's going to be forever on the Sydney calendar and it's going to only get bigger and bigger each year. Well, uh, Art Month is, you know, March is always the, you know, the beginning of our um, year in a sense. Uh, we've got a big push in 2012 with New Zealand Contemporary Art. We'll be showing um, a number of contemporary artists. Mark Blake starts with March, so he's a kind of contemporary New Zealand landscape painter, kind of uh, wonder worlds, sort of mythical landscapes. Um, and with that we'll have a significant education program. Andrew Frost will be giving a series of lectures on contemporary art. We're importing, I suppose you'd use the word, a curator of contemporary art from New Zealand to come and give a couple of lectures. Um, so we'll have an education program and an exhibition program running concurrently. And we'll also do private client dinners, tours, a whole kind of range of events. Um, all around March, which is the beginning of our year. I think it has a huge resonance both in the trade but also to the public and it's in the public sphere of education and kind of broadening knowledge that in fact it's growing in the fastest.